What does it mean to be stuck in a swamp in a dream? Or what does it mean to dream being stuck in a swamp? We can interpret this dream from the physical properties of a swamp or a swampy ground. We know that a swamp is simply a wet ground. This dream, therefore, has two meaning based on its symbolism. Number one, the swamp in the dream may symbolize stagnation or a form of stagnation. Since a swamp is a wet ground, we expect a person to get stuck on the ground or on such ground. Your stability is therefore compromised Hence, your foundation is also faulty. You have no progress as your legs, which symbolize your stability, are held by this messy and muddy ground. Your life is bound, that's why in the physical you are stagnated. There is a change in your income, or whatever you do may always seem never to prosper at all. And this by itself is a sign of a form of stagnation in your life. This not only affects your finance, but also every aspect of your life, including your marriage, children, and also salvation. Whatever you do, you find it that it does not prosper, and therefore you must break such pattern so as to be set free. The second meaning of this dream is that the swamp may be an indicator of a sinful life. You are probably living in sin. You know that sin by itself is very messy. Therefore, Seeing yourself stuck in the mud, muddy ground may indicate your sinful lifestyle. You are comfortable living in sin, and this displeases God. That's why he is warning you and exposing the state of your heart so that you may change and turn to him. David confessed that the Lord had delivered him from muddy clay. That is Psalms 40 verse 3. He was referring to his sinful nature and the mess he had put himself by taking another man's wife. Solomon also likened a sinful man to a pig, which soils itself once cleansed. Wicked men are also likened to a dog that takes back its vomit. This dream is intended to save your soul from defilement. Therefore, it is your responsibility as a Christian to work out your salvation in purity with fear and with trembling. You may ask me, what can I do to save myself from this messy situation? Number one, repent of your sin and commit to following Jesus Christ with a wholehearted devotion. Second Timothy chapter 2 verse 22 declares that flee ye youthful lusts and passions and pursue purity, love, peace together with those who seek the Lord out of a pure heart. Number two, consider doing a personal dedication for the purpose of purification and your protection. And lastly, if you are not born again, then consider doing so today. God is able to heal you from your backsliding state. In Jeremiah chapter 3 verse 22, the Bible declares, Come ye faithful people, and I will heal you of your backsliding state. Just type in Christian Dream Meaning, Christian Dream Meaning dot com. And then it will take you directly to the website, Christian Remaining. So this is my website. You can see it is it's just as beautiful as it is. Right on the home page, you will see a button on the top of the page below the menu. There's this button which says, ask a question. So in case you have a question, you can simply just click this button and it will take you directly to the contact me page. On this page, You'll find some information. Uh, these are some details I'm requiring you to fill. So please make sure to fill all the details as required so that it can make it easier for me to interpret the dream and to know what exactly triggered the dream. You know, sometimes you may watch a movie and then end up dreaming. So the movie is triggered. The dream is triggered by a movie and therefore it may not have any meaning. And sometimes you may read the word of God and as a result, you may end up having a dream. So there are many reasons why you dream. So for that very specific reason, please fill the contact form below, your name, your email address, your occupation, location, your age, and what happened before the dr you had the dream. So try to explain what really happened before you had the dream. Maybe you are watching a movie, maybe you had a quarrel with your husband probably you dreamt divorcing your husband and uh what maybe triggered the dream is 
a quarrel that you end with your husband. So I would also love to know that so that it may help me interpret the dream more effectively. I don't want to over spiritualize everything. You know, there's this tendency of people over spiritualizing dreams when actually the dream is simple. You just have a very simple code to be interpreted. So please make sure to fill the details. And then lastly, you fill your dream. Now you tell me your dream, you write everything about the dream and then you click on the send button and I'll receive the dream in my uh, in my email in my email inbox and I will answer your question to the glory of God in some cases you may find the question to your dream by simply going to the blog page and uh, there's a search button for example you had sex you want to type sex dreams so you just type sex dreams and it will give you a list of sex dreams and you may find your answer in the same. For example, here we have the biblical meaning of having sex with your ex in a dream, you have dreaming of having sex in public. What does it mean to be caught having sex in a dream? And all kinds of dreams. You have dreaming having sex with a mermaid, having sex with your pastor, anal sex and anal rape, and all kinds of other dreams that relate to the same. Like, what does it mean to have sex with a stranger? So you can even find your answers directly from the blog page just click there and probably if you have a question concerning this very specific blog please make sure to write the comment below so that i can know the subject of the dream it makes me it makes it easy for me to know the subject and fill your details and then you post the comment and trust me i'll get back to you within the shortest time possible to the glory of god if you wish to give to my website please Make sure to visit the donation page. You click on the donation page. You can donate to me through PayPal uh, using these donation donation buttons. You can don donate on this button. You can dedicate. For example, you want to dedicate to destroy an evil dream or you want to dedicate to protect your dream. Make sure to click on the dedication button uh, or pay probably you want to donate using cryptocurrency. You can use my crypto username, uh, my Coinbase username, that is at Joshua Mangangi, and I'll receive the coins to the glory of God. If you need to know anything more about me, please visit my about page and you'll find details of what I do and how I do it to the glory of God. And uh, God will be blessed through that. So thank you for your time. May the good God, faithful and holy, bless you. I hope you found this video useful. If you did, please give it a thumbs up and share the clip with friends. And please make sure to visit my website, Christian Dream Meanings, to the glory of God. So thank you. God bless you.